hold still. I'm sure your parents told you this and you may be telling your own kid the same thing now. And we need to remember to hold still when shooting, especially when you need a stable shot. A lot of people go out and hold their cameras out in front of them and that's not a very stable position. So the way you get a still shot is to control where you put the camera. You can pull it into your chest and that's a very stable position. You can hold your arm to some degree but you still have a little bit of movement. You can lean against various objects, chairs, walls, even getting down on the floor to get a shot can work really well. Just think about your choices in keeping your shot stable and don't accept those ugly, shaky shots. You very likely have what is called an image stabilizer built into your camera. And that works really well in most situations to help stabilize. But it's not going to save you from a long, zoomed in shot where your hand is shaking. The best thing to do, if you're able to get yourself in the situation that will allow it, is to use a tripod. Using a tripod gives you versatility in being able to pan and keep everything very steady. But you need to use a very particular type of tripod and that is one with a fluid head. A fluid head allows you to pan smoothly. If you use a tripod designed just for still photography, it will not have a fluid head and it won't help you with nice panning shots. It's better to get the right tripod for shooting video rather than for shooting still pictures. Remember that you have options to stabilize it. It seems like it shouldn't have to be set. But with all of the shaky images we see, people just aren't remembering to do something about it. Try different positions and find what works for your particular situation and hold still. Shaky shots are one of the biggest reasons people's videos look bad, yet so few people do anything to correct the problem. Use a tripod and learn how to hold your camera for better stability.